Hey, Rick, Lisa, and Nick. Just want to take a, a moment here and uh, wish you a uh, a very happy Veterans Day. If you or some member of your family has served, we we, we thank you for that. Yes, we we thank you and salute you. And we uh, on my family, we don't have a whole lot of uh, military uh, heritage throughout the years. Uh, so I don't. I when I talk about this, I really don't understand. But I what I do understand is how well and how dedicatedly long and difficult it is for those who do it. So I thank you. And same here, except I did discover that both my grandfathers, neither of which I knew because they died long before I was born, um, were both in the military, one in World War I and war, one in World War II. Mm -hmm. And um, Harry, my mother's father, was in World War I and was missing in action. MIA. And MIA and his um, troop from Pennsylvania, they were surrounded and ambushed. There were 500 of them. Only 150 survived, and they had to, they were like five miles out so they could get back. And um, it, they're, they're now referred to as the men of iron. Men of iron. Yeah, because it was unlikely that they would survive that. And he did. He was one that survived it. So, or I wouldn't be here. So, oh. wow. You know, you dig into your family history and you, you learn a lot. So we, we, we thank you again for your service. We thank the, the families that sacrifice for that. And uh, when I say God bless and have, have a wonderful day.